I mean, I think you had kind of the moment of the night when your family surprised yeah, you. Yeah, you know, that's right. A show in the voice. They should have called it a surprise. Yeah. Um, because that was a great one. Yeah, I mean, uh, you I almost cursed on live TV. I did, actually. I almost did it. My guilty conscience got the better of me. I'm sure NBC is super thankful for that because oh, they would... I wish I could have been a fly on the wall. They're like, oh, no. You know, how close I got to it. But I, I haven't seen it yet, but somebody told me they did actually beat me out. Did they? Yeah, okay. So. It sounded like you had managed to just keep yourself. I wasn't right. sure if they had actually... But okay. I, I hope they beeped me, even because that, that way I didn't fully cuss, and if they beeped me, you know, I, I beeped on national It'll TV. be nice and clean on the West Coast version. It'll never have happened. That's right. That's right. It never happened. So. so, I mean, what did it mean to you now to know that your family was here to witness the show? It's, so, it's you know, I think there's a certain poetry about it, to say the least. Uh, you know, I, I, it was my wife's birthday. Yeah. Uh, I, was, I wasn't expecting to see her. I was about to send a heartfelt message to say, sorry, love, can't be home. Yeah. And she appears. Uh, and, you know, I actually signed the song with her in mind. Uh, I mean, that was what I wanted to do. I felt like that was the right approach to the song to help me get into it. And I don't know, it just feels like every, every, everything went well tonight. So, Was there any concern about ta tackling a Blake song? I think um, the, my only concern was that I had to do it justice uh, because, I mean... You know, Blake's made a hit out of it, so yeah. you know people might question the sanity of taking a hit song and trying to make it a hit again differently. Yeah. Um, but the truth is, a good song is a good song, uh, and transferring it back to you know into a rock and roll format. Uh, actually it was a pleasure and you, you can't undo good songwriting and that's what it is, it's good songwriting. So all I had to do was really try and bring a bit of me and I hope I did. Yeah, and well, hey, Adam seemed to enjoy it. He did, he did, and he's always very complimentary, it's very flattering, and, you know, he, he's, he's actually said off camera a couple of times what he thinks and, you know, I can't, it's very humbling. I mean, is it, how much interaction do you get with the other coaches aside from Blake off camera? Um, you know, now and again, I mean, when everybody's kind of at the end of a day, it's, no. you know, everybody's, obviously everybody's got things to go and do, and right. you know, sometimes we finish and we go straight in rehearsals for the next week, you know, sometimes that's what happens. Yeah. Um, so, but uh, when there is time, you know, sometimes you catch it on camera after stage and people have a chat, and it's nice actually, they've all been great.